today I'm going to be showing you guys my nose. And I've been wearing this look a lot lately, so I've been seeing this video going on a lot too, so I have nothing on my face. So I'm going to start out with Clean and Clear Dual Action Moisturizer. And if you're in my new subbies, my older subbies know that I have been wearing this a lot lately. So this is what I use every day to apply. I apply a few coats to my fingers and I just rub them together to warm up the product. And I just apply it to my face. For foundation, I have been obsessed with the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1. I think I need to go back to my local Walmart and buy the next to the last shade. And I believe that this one kind of makes my skin look orange on camera. But off camera, I'm going to mix this shade and then the foundation that I'm going to go ahead and try to repurchase again. We'll go get and I'm going to mix them up. And maybe that will give my actual... Uh, skin tone and also actual color that I need to have because this is a really good foundation I'm just going to use this Coastal Scents Flat Top Kabuki sorry if it's already dirty but I'm going to use it and I'm going to apply it to my skin go back over my dark circles just my dark circles and I'm just going to use this brush and blend it out Now I'm going to take the Wet n Wild. Mine had broke. So I'm just going to take my Wet n Wild bronzer. I'm trying to use the life out of this stuff. And I'm going to take this brush from Coastal Scents. And I'm going to take it and I'm going to use it to contour. Now I'm going to set my face with the Revlon Nearly Naked Press Powder. And this is what I use almost every day, y'all. I love this stuff. And the brush I am using is the L Total Face Brush. Now I'm going to take the Wet n Wild Blush, excuse me, and I'm going to use that same brush that we used to contour, and I'm going to use Personal Lint Pink.
Then I'm going to take a primer. I'm going to take my NYX primer and I'm going to use my 217 brush by MAC and I'm going to take the primer and I'm going to apply it to my eyes first. Then I'm going to take the NYX Jumbo Pencil in a jar. Well, excuse me, I deposited my Jumbo Basin Milk, but it's now in a jar. I'm going to apply it to my lid. Now I'm going to go ahead and just finish off my eye look. And I'm going to show you guys the colors and stuff. So I'm going to zoom in. And I'm going to use my San Francisco palette from BH. I'm going to use these colors as my translucent color. Then I'm going to take the black from the palette and then I'm going to slightly apply it to the crease. Then I'm going to take the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette and I'm going to take Walk of Shame or WOS, that's what it stands for. And I'm going to apply it to my lids. Rocket 
Express by Maybelline. Look at all products will be listed below and I had to go and I will see you guys in my next tutorial.